Hello guys and welcome to another episode. Yes, it's been a while, yeah, it's a whole week and I do apologise and as you can tell I've still got like this stupid flu, whatever. So I think so I do apologise guys, um basically for, for not being on, but I, I just couldn't talk. I lost my voice or anything, so I've got a bit of my voice back now, so where we left off was the poll. Would you like to see three games or two games in a video? And you voted 75% to 25% of three games per video. So that's fine. So as you can see, it's going to be Watford, Everton and Bournemouth in this episode. Unless, obviously, that gets changed with like rescheduling or anything like that. So that's what we've got. We played Watford, obviously, in the Carabao Cup final and we won. So hopefully now we can continue from that amazing, yes, amazing 7-0 victory. Um over Crystal Palace, which will... It's there on the screen above me, right there. Yeah, 7-0. Um, that was weird, but anyway. Uh, without further ado, guys, let's get back on. Oh, the other thing that I wanted to talk about was I've had a play around, obviously, with not being too good, but I can still play the game and stuff like that. And I found a formation that suits my play style better, I feel. Um, it might not be... You know, good for you guys. You might think, mm, not keen on it. It's, it's just literally it's four four two, but I've got slightly adjusted. So I've got like as you can see, the second striker is slightly in a, a um, drop down. He's like playing more in a false nine, um, so he is kind of like an attacking midfielder. So Coutinho, Correa, you know those sort of players that can play there. And then I've also got Chan, who's just slightly a little bit deeper. So he's like a more defensive midfielder, whereas Goretzka, as you can see, is like slightly pushed forward. So fingers crossed, this formation will work because it seems to have been. I've been playing on another save, which is nothing to do with this. It's just like a practice save that I do to get me like used to the game controls and things like that. And I've been winning. So let's 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 see how it goes up against Watford. Here we go, because we need to win to catch Manchester United at the top because you don't want them winning so here we are at Anfield evening kickoff against Watford um, let's see how we get on hopefully fingers crossed we can continue on our winning ways ok Robertson lays this back again inside Goretzka's got a bit of space goes for a long shot Cornelius does a good save it's still in play Barco oh it just just came off the side of him like unfortunately just trying to you know keep control of that as you can see we're the best defensive team in the league with 22 against us chance of Barco to hound and press this is what we want to do oh nicely done Bailey's intercepted that Trent Alexander didn't it didn't flick to him um, Ricardison chance here oh well Okaka there nearly catches Horn out that is close try near post again from this side Werner. Okay. Bailey's going to pick this up. Alexander Arnold. That's it. Chan's on side. Can he get a cross in? Werner. Ah. Oh. Wasn't the best of crosses. Gretzky, can we fight for that? Oh. It's just all a bit scrappy in there at the moment. Far too scrappy. Yeah, and it's half time, nil nil. So, a very. Uh, Scrappy kind of game so far. Watford are just closing me down. I'm trying to find space here, and I can't find any. Okay, Robertson's done well here. Can he get a ball in? Oh, unlucky. Timo Werner's picked this up. Uh, he's got to play this back out. Trying Alexander Arnold. Chan back over to this side. Robertson again. Can he get a good ball in? Gone for the far post, Bailey. Tried, but yeah, tried. We need a win, guys. We need a win. A, a draw is no good. We've had too many draws. Timo Werner, Correa, can he get inside? Can he shoot? Oh, Kinesis. He's just been an absolute rock today for them. And we need to make a change now. Oh, man. What to do? Bailey's going to come off. Oxley Chamberlain going to come on. Uh, do I bring Smoloff on? Yes, I do. I'm going to bring Smoloff on, team him up with Werner for the first time. 
Come on. Let's get this, guys. It's flipped in. Head on this. Matip! Yes! Joel Matip gets the header from the corner. I think it, it needed to be something like that. Like, you know what I mean? Because Watford were just defending so well. Joel Matip now has given us the, the, the lead, the advantage. But we need to like obviously hold on to this and not be like Liverpool in real life who just give away like leads at the moment, especially a 3-0 one, which was absolutely ridiculous to give away a 3-0. Um but then again, um same could be said for AC Milan in two thousand five. Different circumstances, obviously. Continue. Uh, just lay this back to Chan. Into Goretzka. Oh, okay, not into Goretzka. Virgil van Dijk will get it into Goretzka. Who in turn will find Timo Werner. Who in turn will find Smolov. Who has just come on. It's his first touch. This guy. You guys said. Why did I buy him? That's why I bought him. Okay. You, were, you Some of you. I'm not saying all of you. But you did say like. You know what I mean. What have you bought Smolov for? Like you know what I mean. Who is this guy? We're, I played with him on my ultimate team. And he scores goals for me. Like you know what I mean. And he's. I mean he got a hat trick against. Crystal Palace, he's just come on, it's his first touch, look at this, bang, back of the net, 2-0 up, I'm not having a go at you guys, you know that, you know what I mean, but what I'm saying is like, you know, have a bit of faith, <laughs> that's all I was saying, like, you know, oh, Trent Alexander-Arnold, come on, can we keep a clean sheet here, Timo Horn headed back by, no, what are you doing? What was that? And there it is, guys. 2-0. Um, and it was it was 2-1 in the FA, in the FA Cup. A Carabao Cup final. So, I am sorry, uh, Danger Gerbil, because I know Watford is your team, but we have beaten you yet again. It was tough. Watford give me a tough game. They are very, very good at um, hounding players and defending well, but really good. How well did we play? 11 shots, 8 on target. They only had the one shot on target. Um, not bad at all. Like So hopefully you guys like the new formation. And Trent Alexander-Arnold gets man of the match. Well done to him. Um, I don't know. I mean... I don't know. Well, well, you know. Well done. How long is... Be out for eight weeks. <sighs> Barker was out for eight weeks. Just to get his shoulder. Come on. I just have no luck on this. What's this? What a massive victory, boss. I told you that select me with spur or something. Oh, okay. We're going into the Everton game, knowing that obviously a win would actually put us top. Well, depending on obviously Manchester United's result. Who actually Manchester United playing? That's interesting. West Brom. Are they? Why are they not? They're not. I don't know. Okay, we could go top. All right, if we beat Everton. Right, okay. Because for some reason, Manchester United are not playing. No, that's the kit we want. So guys, here we are at Goodison Park with our chance to go top of the Premier League. Obviously the more goals that we score, the better it's going to be for goal difference because that could be like the, the deciding factor, you know, the way that everything is so close at the moment. So Emery Chan captaining the, captaining, captaining, captaining. <laughs> The, the side today. Um, whether he's going to be an actual Liverpool player in real life anymore, uh, I don't know, because there's a lot of talk about Juventus and stuff. So what I've done is I've put Bailey on the left and I've put Oxlade Chamberlain has come in on the right. So here we go. Come on. There's our derby. What a chance to go top against our rivals here. Martina. Oh, that's a poor ball. Smoloff is onto this. And there's a chance here. Oxley Chamberlain, going for it. Oh, he's at the post. Oh my god. Oh my god. He's at the post. What a start that would have been. Oxley Chamberlain there, far side. Timo Werner here taking the throw in, which is kind of weird. Robertson. 
Right, it's a great start. Chan. Here we go. Ricardo Pereira. Chan. Ah, uh, he's going to... Uh, I knew that just as soon as I went to do it. And I was like, stupid. That Rooney's playing. Mm. Sigurdsson. Sandro. Chamberlain. Okay. Throw to Pereira. Okay, keep going forward. All right, cut inside. Here's Goretzka. Small off. Chan. Bring this over to this wing. Chance for Bailey here. Can he get. Oh, he's done. Uh, unlucky. Nearly got past him there. Chance, Goretzka. Bailey's going again. I think that's the wrong ball, but. Smolov, he's gone for the dink over the top. It's Oxley Chamberlain, can he get hold of this? He can. Turn. Yes! This time, he has put it in the net. Oh, we were on fire. What a start this is. Like, you know what I mean? We're just moving forward fluently. The players are like, all up for this. This is I can't believe that they didn't get clear of that. Great. I was going to think, lay it off for Smolov. No, just try and curl this in the bottom corner. Pickford is beaten. 1-0. He hit the post like literally within the first like minute or so, like, and now he's like buried it. Well played. Nice. Robertson. Inside. Werner. Chan. Gretzka. Got loads of space over this side. Oxlade like Chamberlain. Pereira's going. Can he get a ball in? He can small off. Oh come on! At Goodison Park. And we are just killing them right now. Great ball in. And what a volley. Thank you very much. Smolov again. <laughs> well, uh, it's all. it was all about Werner, wasn't it? It was all about team of Werner. But this guy is, is smashing it. You know what I mean? He is literally smashing it. Like. Sigurdsson, nice turn inside. Rooney lays this off. Whoa, that's a good ball out. Oh, that's a good take as well. Flipped in. Good head on this. It's wide. Okay. Should have won the header there. Just mm. This is nice. Gretzka to Chamberlain. There's a chance for Bailey. Can he get on this? Can he get on this? Oh, Pickford does really well. Man, that could have been three. It's a great ball. Oh, a little dink inside. Oh, ref, thank you. Pick this in, far post. Werner. Oh, got it caught that well on the volley. Pickford does well to save it. Catches that sweet. And straight at him, though. There's a chance. Going for the long shot. Oh, ho, ho. Jonathan Tarr there. Went for it. Unlucky. Why not? I just thought, let's have a go. Let's see what the centre-back can do. Went too far off, to be fair. Wasn't too far off. Just have a look at our time. Yeah, as you can see, they've had a couple of shots, but nothing major, whereas we've had seven, so... Okay, Henry Chan. Mm. Struggling a bit there, isn't he? Bring the Naldem on. So change it half time. I brought with Naldem on in place of Chan because he was like looking very tired. So a little bit of a change in midfield, give it a bit more energy because we seem to be losing the ball quite a bit in midfield. I'm going to take Goretzka and Bailey off because of fitness and Coutinho and Ben Woodburn are going to come on. And um, hopefully it will boost Ben Woodburn's confidence a little bit because it is lacking at the moment. So, Chamberlain, Sai, Coutinho, lays this off. Wijnaldum goes a long shot. He has just buried this in the bottom corner. Oh, ho, ho, ho. what a goal. The long ranger, and he scored from well, away from home. So there you go. The Everton fans are not happy. I've seen it open up for bang. And he's buried it in the bottom corner. We are 3-0 up here, guys. We're in control. Got it sorted. I'm happy with this formation. Things are looking good. I mean, it's coming towards the end of the season, but things are looking good. Uh, 
which is like all good for like next season and who knows we could still snatch this Premier League that's his first Premier League goal as well um, we could still snatch this Premier League title which would be awesome all depends on whether somebody could do us a favour and beat Man United because we only managed to draw which was a shame because we were all over them Here's a chance for Sandra. Oh, Pereira's got pulled out of position. Oh, but De Vrij says, oh, I don't think so. I'm going to cover for my teammate there. Pereira's now back. Coutinho. He's gone over the top here. Oh, Axley Chamberlain brings this down. Fights. Ah, oh, damn it. Inside. Werner. Um, loses out. Damn it. Keen. That was a good ball through for Sandro. He's one on one. And he fluffs his lines, basically. I don't know if it was De Vry that put him off or whatever, but that shooting was absolutely terrible from Sandro. Um, yeah. Long ball up. Is he going to blow? Not yet. Coutinho. Chance. Smolov. Venus Moray gets there. Still not blowing. Rosparky nearly losing out. Ronaldo, chance, Smolov goes again, ah, try it for number four, but there we go, 3-0 guys, against Everton, great result, and that should, but it's top of the league, uh, let's see everyone else, pretty good, pretty good, Prayer are doing really well as well, yeah, well done guys, it seems to be working. It seems to be going in the right direction. Even with our depleted side. Because this game just hates me. And wants to keep giving me injuries. And look at this. Oh, look at this, guys. Look where we are sitting. Sitting where we should sit every season. Top of the Premier League. Yes, Manchester United do have a game in hand. But it means they have to win it. Like, you know what I mean? And that's the pressure that you put on them. And the same goes um, for Spurs. I mean, uh, you know, Spurs can go ahead as well if they win their game in hand. So it's tight. It is very, very tight at the top. Uh, yeah. They need player development. Let's change this, actually. Uh, yeah, there we go. Simulate all. Nice. Go on, go up, go up. Oh, Gallo's flying up. Okay. Okay, so this is the team that will, um, is going to face Bournemouth. Uh, and hopefully we can make it three wins out of three, guys. As you can see, Manchester United have gone back to the top of the table so we were like there for a short period Chelsea have actually now played an extra game than us so that doesn't mean it's Spurs oh no they still haven't played okay it's just unbelievable how tight it is at the top this is just gonna I don't know how this is gonna end out it's just nuts we just need we need Man United to lose is, is, is one Could do with, oh man this is just crazy Alright, let's take on Bournemouth. We're at home, so that's something. Oh, nicely played through there from Arta, like Defoe. Gotta watch out for him. He's still quick even though he's 33 or something, 34. Great save by Horn. There we go, Defoe, straight away. It's a bit central, but good hands on it. We've got a corner, gotta be on it. Come on. Let's get it. Oh it's looped. Wide, Bournemouth for um, causing his problems straight away. I don't know, Coutinho's just, I don't know, maybe he's not the right player to put in that position. Because he just isn't performing very well at the moment. Pereira has a great chance through. That was a great chance for Defoe yet again. And I think he's pulled his shot. Opened up here. Where the hell my central defenders disappeared to, I have no idea. Damn it. Chan. Here's Goretzka now. He's in the position. He's got a chance for Oxley Chamberlain. Can he pull this? Ah, oh, there's a chance. Ah, oh, Werner's trying to come in the far post and not able to squeeze that in. 
Robertson just lays this off to Bailey. We'll lay this back now to Emery Chan, who in turn knocks this inside to Goretzka. Back to Pereira. Come on, we're looking for a, a way through here, guys. Here's Emery Chan. Looks at the ball inside. It's Felix Coutinho. He goes to the shot. Bekovic just takes that so easy. That's the seven, yeah. Definitely ahead. Okay, come on. We need something. Coutinho. Van Dyke. All right, here's Robertson. Bailey. Inside. Chan. Robertson. Back to Chan. Finds Goretzka, who finds Coutinho, who's looking for Goretzka, but Gosling says, no, mate. You're not, you're not getting through. Bailey. There it is. There's the ball I wanted. Robertson. Oh, that's not the ball I wanted. It's a poor cross. I need players that can cross. I mean, that's that's been my downfall. Is I just haven't got players that can cross a ball. Like that's the biggest downfall I've had in this like so-called season so far. Great interception from Bailey. Can he find the ball? Then ah, oh, Ake's there. The defending really well, Bournemouth. It's like it's like Watford game, but even worse. I think you know what I mean. It's just. Watford didn't seem to have the threat up front. Bournemouth had definitely got more of a threat up front for some reason. Right. Greska just pulled away from the ball. Gosling. Come on. Nice. Pereira. It's a chance. Uh, there's nothing. There's no one on. There's nobody on. No one's getting forward. Where is Bailey? Where the hell is Bailey? Here he is. Where the hell have you been? Robertson. Right, can you get a cross in this time? He's gone for the far post. Damn it. Jario's there. I don't know. He's just not at the races today, unfortunately. Let's see if Correa can do anything better. Robertson. Okay, now we've got Bailey back on this wing. He's gone for the ball through. Oh, yes. No, yes. I thought he put it over. I honestly thought that he put that over then. Man. But he hasn't. He's put it in the top corner. <sighs> Eventually, we've managed to break this defence down. Great ball through. Correa makes the run. Flicks it across. And I thought he put it over. I thought, oh... Look at this, I thought, no, shit, oh, but no, top corner. All right, guys, oof, 1-0. Okay. We got there in the end, broke him down, All right. Bailey, let's get Bailey, Chan, the chance for Werner. Cut this in. Oh, Cook's there again. Cook is like just everywhere. Pereira. Correa. Ah, oh, I thought that's like Jamie could get back Daniels. Why are these players like, play, like unbelievable yeah, right now? Uh, get rid of it. A chance here it's gone through. It's Timo Werner. Surely. Oh my god, how did Begovic save that? How does he save that? Why is Timo Werner like leaning back when he's like hitting that? I went for a finesse shot in the bottom corner. Slowed him down. Right, let's let's hold this out in this corner. Here we go. Let's go. Ah, no, there it is, yes, that's the three points guys, that's what we needed, so we've had three games today guys, we've had three wins, um, even though I'm feeling like crap, we've managed to get through it, like sort of thing, um, and I apologise that obviously we've not been able to get any up, but we've got it, and it's keeping that pressure on the other teams that are around us, and that's what we need to do, Premier League, thank you, where are you, there we go, oh we're back on top, so Manchester United have still got to play their game. 
we sit on 62 points with Manchester United. Um, Chelsea has 61. Spurs have still got two games to play. I don't understand. They must be... Why, is it, why are they not playing their matches? Is it Champions League? Is that what it is? Could be. Could be Champions League matches that are holding them up. Because um, unfortunately we got knocked out of that. But as you can see guys, look how close it is. Spurs technically, if they win the two games in hand, will go top by a point on 63. Um, Manchester United will go above us um, on 65. Yeah, so that's how it'll sit. So if everyone plays their game in hand, we still sit third, don't we? Yeah, because Spurs will go 63, Man U will be 65, we'll be on 62, yeah. Uh, we need Matt, someone to beat Manchester United. That's what we need for us to win this title. But look how close. We've got four games left of the season, guys. Or well, the Premier League season, anyway. But next up... Um, in, in video wise is going to be obviously the semi-final of the FA Cup then there's a Premier League game against Stoke and then another Premier League game against West Bromwich Army so two fairly easy I say that with a bit of hesitancy games in the Premier League and um, the tough one is going to obviously going to be the Chelsea game that Chelsea game could possibly decide the title depending on like what else is happening around and stuff like that um, and hopefully at the end of the Brighton game there'll be a, an FA Cup final as well because hopefully we'll beat Manchester United but that's what we've got to look forward to in the next match guys I'm sorry again for being ill and stuff and um, hope you guys aren't as ill um, and feeling better and stuff like that but I'm a hell of a lot better uh, Danger Gerbil will vouch for that because I have been trying to talk to him um, over the last few days and stuff um, but yeah guys, take it easy, I will catch you as soon as I can on the next video, I'm going to try and get one up um, ASAP for you guys to try and catch up, um, but yeah, it should be coming to an end this season, and then we can start the next season which will be going to be great, and also going into that will be the start of the new career mode with um, Grimsby Town, if you don't want it to be Grimsby Town, just head over to my Twitter um, it is pinned at the top of my Twitter and just change it by voting for one of the other teams that are in there but Grinsey is way out in front at the moment I will also leave the link down in the comments section well not just not the comments but the description section of this video if you click on there you'll go straight to the straw poll and you can vote for who you want to see me do a sort of road to glory uh, but at the moment it looks like it's going to be Grinsby taking them back to the big time because apparently Grinsby were in the Premier League, well when it wasn't called the Premier League, but the First Division back in 1937, I think it was. So it would be nice to take them back to the to the heights of that. But anyway guys, um, take it easy, I will catch you on the next um, video. Um, this is Dave from Moomongo Gaming signing off. If you are new to the channel, please go ahead and, and, and subscribe guys. That would be um, awesome. Um, just do a quick drill. Just to end off and see if anyone like does increase. Maybe Bailey, does he get up to 79? He does. There we go. Gallo gets up to 54. Bailey gets up to a 79. So that's a good way to end stuff. So take it easy, guys. Catch you on the next video. Dave from Moomongo Gaming signing off. Cheers.